I want to take you back for a second. I've been watching Viewless for a long time. And yeah, mixtapes, they're cool and all, but I just need to see a player in person to make a fair assessment. The first time I saw Euless play was at the Ball is Life All-American game. First, he won the three-point contest, so that kind of answered whether he could shoot or not. But then when he played, I was really in shock of how in control this kid was at all times. He had the composure of a grown man playing against little boys. He never got rattled, and he was tough as nails. He really wanted to let it be known that he was the best. He was the shortest guy on the court, but he was always under control. It didn't look like it, but he was fast as heck. I knew then that he was going to be a good college guard. I knew then that he would be a guy that I could show to young players. Now, Tyler, sometimes you don't know how good he is because things come so easy and under control. And that leads to my first point. His poise at his height allows him to play at this level. He doesn't panic when the more athletic guys guard him. He just protects the ball while still being able to make heads up plays. I wouldn't say that he's the best shooter, but he can shoot it, no doubt. You can't leave him open. He can shoot it off the dribble and spot it. What this allows him to do is stretch the floor out for his team. What I like about him that people don't pay enough attention to is these crisp passes that he gives to his teammates. He always makes sure that they're catchable depending on his personnel. And also, he keeps the dribble alive when he needs to and sets up a play. Besides being deceptively fast, Euless is just fearless. He goes to the rack like he's 6'8", but he attacks it aggressively, seemingly to score. What this does is allow kickouts because the defense has the help. He's good at kicking the ball out to shooters, but he won't get in too deep unless he's dumping it off to a big. The problem I see with a lot of younger players, they consistently get in too deep so they make turnovers. The closer you get to the basket, the longer the arms get and the harder it is to make these kickouts. So younger players, beware of this. I challenge you to watch you listen, and pay attention to some of this stuff. There will be a part two to this. Still some things that I believe that make him a great college point guard. Make sure to like the page and subscribe to YouTube. I'm posting different content on all the social media channels.